<laughs> hey, look, this is real hilarious. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like grass right now, trying to talk to an oak tree. You know what I mean? These rich people in California are hiring private workers, private companies to combat the fires that are blazing aloft in California. You know, like they can't even figure out when it's going to stop, when it's going to start, none of that. <laughs> Freaking hilarious, man. Like, they, they, they really think that they can go against... Understand this, if that truly was a battle of Armageddon, Armageddon to me would simply be a level playing field, a leveling, uh, uh, the leavening power of, of, of the Father, and on leveled ground, everyone being made the exact same, or being manifested to be the exact same, because truth is the leavening power of God. You understand me? When you, when you realize that we are all nothing but sheer dust and ash before His presence, you will find out and it's hilarious to me the only way you can battle against the father is to use your resources to combat him from the things that he's doing to to try to alleviate because you can't reach him to slap him in his face or to to unsheathe your sword and, and make a strike so that you catch him so in order for you <laughs> To overcome what's happening, you got to hire private people. Use your money and your resources to combat what's going on. Let me explain something to y'all. <laughs> your God, and I'm talking to you, Israel. Your God is found in all of His feasts, in all of His appointed times, in all of His appointed hours. And now is the time for you to be looking with that king eye of yours to find the God you've been looking for. That same El Shaddai that spoke to uh, uh, Abraham and, and, and blessed and, and cursed anybody who touched him, you know? And to find the Father in his appointed times, your, I, right now is the time to look for your God, Israel. Look for him. And I guarantee you, in this hour, you will find it. And let me give you some help. The mathematic, the, mac, the, the mathematic precision and perfection of the hand of God. He's found in his appointed feasts. And the hour, the appointed feast that is now, is the day of atonement. You see, that Day of Atonement is meant to be a single day of uh, uh, retribution, of judgment, of all these things. That's what it's meant to be. And so, right now you can look and see the hand of God moving in all of the earth. And you can find Him right now moving and judging. See, were these judgments random? Then it would be hard to Decipher the hand of God But then for the judgments to be exact I mean This is the right thing that's happening To the right people For the right reasons You understand So that's when you know The hand of God is beginning to move in the earth And right now the day of atonement the See cause What y'all need to understand All of these holidays that we have These holy days Correctly spoken all of these holy days that we have right now, I'm going to tell you like this. They were all prophecies. We know that, right? It's, it's, not, it's not foreign science. They were all prophecies meant to happen. That's going to happen. And what we have is in that hour, in that time throughout the year, because the Day of Atonement is the day of judgment and then the great feast that follows the 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 the, the feast of tabernacles okay that's meant to follow is our liberation that we it, 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 the only thing that's waiting to happen right now is for us to meet at the banquet family 
And that's when you're going to find, that's, uh, again, at that point to the hour, you're going to find the guy that you've been looking for. And right now, it's time for you to look. Because the time is now, the hour is now. Look for the hand of God and you will find him. I guarantee you. And his hand is precise. You know, they are hiring private workers to combat the hand of God. <laughs> and those who are in their right mind would say simply foolish. No, the only way I'm going to tell you like this, you world, and I'm talking to you now. The only way you will alleviate this, not combat it, but alleviate this is the same measure that he gave to us when we went under the thumb of the Babel, uh, uh, in, in, in Babylon, okay? Uh, the thumb of the leaders in Babylon, okay? Right now, guess whose thumb you got to place yourself under? Israel. You got to place yourself under our thumb now. It's about the, it's, it, that's the only solace, the only help that you're going to have. There is no amount of money. There is no togetherness. No, no, no uh, uh, number that you can form, that you can put together to combat what's happening to you right now. It's just going to simply happen. And so the only way to alleviate and to keep this from coming down upon your shoulders... <laughs> Is for you to serve or perish. And your object, your focal object when it comes down to where do I go to start this service? How do I begin my servitude? Hello, the people of Israel are here. And of our good pleasure, our free will speaking. The Most High isn't going to say, Israel, tell them to do this. No, he's leaving it all up to us to freely tell you what to do. <laughs> oh my goodness. And thus, this is where we come into play. You know, while he's manifesting who he is as El Shaddai, the same God who cursed the one who touched Sarah, Abraham's wife, right? At the very moment, uh, 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 the, the, the evil uh, Egyptian, the Pharaoh, wanted to touch his wife. He was cursed at that very moment. Well, now El Shaddai is back and he's doing his thing. And he's making blessings and curses happen on behalf of the one in whom he has established his promise and covenant. You all, all of this is going to trickle down to you all finding out. See, the Most High's hand is so precise. All of these judgments are going to happen. And then all y'all going to start to look and search out what's going on. You, you, you worldly. And you're going to find out that you're, you're exact. You're going to say, oh, wait a second. This is exactly what's been written in the scriptures. And then you're going to find out if this is what's written in the scriptures, these judgments that are coming down, what's written in the scriptures that's going to help us alleviate these problems because your want and your need in, 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 your, in, your, in your chaos is going to rise and rise and rise until somebody amongst your company finally realizes and says, wait a second, this is God. What then does he want us to do? And you will read, you will search and find out that what he wants you to do is the, ble the, 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 the blessing of Abraham that you all, <laughs> you know, exalt so much where it says, blessed will I bless those who bless you and cursed will I curse those who curse you, O Abraham and seed of the promise. And then you will find out that there's more to that promise that real that that says that you will possess the gates of your enemies and 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 the whole world will be blessed through you. So understand this world, your focal point is the people of God. I'm gonna tell you just like that. Point blank period. And all y'all who acting like you don't realize it, who remain docile and who do not point out the simple fact of the truth of the matter. He's going to strategically continue doing what he's doing until you all finally look at us. You can keep turning your head. You can keep looking the other way. 
But then sooner or later, y'all gonna turn around and finally look, wait a second, what wrong am I doing with my hands? Because it's no longer, you know, what money do I have to alleviate my problems? You are gonna start saying, what am I doing wrong that's causing this to happen to me? Because the righteous have been living their whole life realizing that all bad and all good that has happened to them has been the hand of God, period. Blessed is the one is the man who finally sees in his life that there is absolutely nothing that happens that God is unaware of. If he knows the exact number of the drops of rain that fall throughout the seasons, if he knows the name of each and every star that he placed and hung on nothing in the sky, if he knows the exact numbers of the hairs on your head and throughout your whole body, how be it? family, bro. I'm about to go off, bro. How be it, bro? That y'all don't realize that what's happening right now is the hand of God strategically placed so he knows the number and name of the curses that are befalling your head. I promise you he does. <laughs> and you rich, you want to think you can hire private people to combat the father? See, this is how in Armageddon you're going to be combating him because you can't fight him head on. No, you're going to try to alleviate what he's doing. And he's going to continue to say, you can't stop this. Nah, this is happening. El Shaddai is happening. You understand? It is coming down upon your head through Yahweh. You feel me? And it's happening. Where you guys need to understand that the law that's established by the God that we serve is now exacting its own. And now, the imputed sins, the imputed transgressions that you all have accumulated is now coming down on the entire world upon your own head. Where you thought, see in the book, <laughs> where you, in, in, the, in the word of God, it speaks about the great host that encompasses every man, every star, every breath of air, every, uh, every uh, rain, every wall, every creature, are all witnessing your sins. And you can't hide them from the, 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 the Father who sees all, right? El Rohi is what they call him. He sees everything, family. And now, y'all who have lived your life thinking that you got away with it, thinking that you, that, that, that you somehow slipped the hand of God, he's going to find out just how much you've slipped. Oh yeah, you slipped, and you slipped greatly, and you fell and hit your head, and now you're in a coma. And the Most High is getting ready to wake you up out that coma, only to put you right back into one. Y'all, this fine. You can't stop this. Stop trying to stop it. Y'all can't do nothing to, to alleviate this problem. It's about to happen to you. So it's, it's, you done. You done. And when you finally realize this, see, all y'all minds are getting ready to be focused to one, to, 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 to two points, really. That there is a God. And who in the world are his, his true people? Not his fake people in, in the, the Israeli and Israel right now, but the true people scattered throughout the entire earth. Those same ones y'all put through slave ships. Those same ones y'all put through all types of trial and tribulation. They are the ones that you all will remember soon enough. For they are the Sabbath of the Father that the whole earth needs to remember truly to tell you the truth. And now, see, because I'm giving y'all mysteries simply while, while condemning these wicked. But I'm going to tell you like this. In California, y'all y'all funny. And every time y'all do something, y'all do nothing but fulfill the, 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 the commandments. Y'all do not fulfill the word of, uh, of, the, of the Father. Every time you make an effort against him, he has already seen it happening. So he knows the efforts that you're going to make. The things that you're gonna do. And so, there's already been act procured against you. He's already procured every single thing that 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 that, that works against you. And now <laughs> it's time for y'all to, to to hey, 
Israel over here. We we are here. Those who you thought was not a people, hey, we're we're a people, and y'all about to find out. Y'all about to find out that we are a people. And sooner or later, it's just all gonna trickle down to these other people. This is Israel. This is the this is the God, and He's real. <laughs> And then now y'all gonna just have to follow suit. That's point point blank, period. According to scriptures, any nation that does not serve will perish. Now is the time. In America, welcome to the rapture. Well, not the rapture, because you know I, I, I have a whole other thing to say about that, but welcome to the wrath of God. Finally broke your walls. All your all your little all your little monies and your power that you thought that you can use to hold back the wrath of God, you can hold it back no more. Palestine, I see you going through your problems and your trials and tribulations. You've done some wicked things, obviously. See, just because we're ignorant of the wickedness that you've done, the Father is not. And so he's acting according to the wickedness that we know not. You know, everybody's getting it right now. And foolish is the man who continues to turn up his nose at what's happening right now. Who's be, who continues to say it's all benign. Foolish are you. Now you getting it. Now you starting to see it. And even if you don't see it, it doesn't matter whether you see it or whether you're not. This is, this is happening, family. Period. Point blank period. This is happening. But I just want to do this video real quick, you know, just to laugh. Because the father's also laughing and winking at the world. You know, the more they continue to try to combat him, he continues to laugh at you. You're going to hire private companies just to combat these fires that are happening to you. No, 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 no. Shame on you. <laughs> but that's exactly what you're supposed to do. Because as you continue to combat him... Your resources are, are going to continue to dwindle. You see, because you rich, that wealth that you have was for the very in intent and purpose for you to give it to the needy and poor. Now, the father requires your wealth <laughs> to be given to, 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 to those in whom your wealth has been stored up for. You see, you were meant to store it up. And you don't understand, the father got you played. You were meant to store up your wealth in order that you that your wealth be taken away from you and given to the righteous so that the righteous can use the wealth that is, uh, for, the, for the reason in which all wealth that, of the father is meant to be for him. And he is in all things. And now, I'm going to tell you like this. World, announcement. All your wealth is required. Give it up. It's time for you to give it up. All your wealth is required right now by the people of God. We are requiring your wealth. Give it up now. Oh, man, look, I, I, I'm about to go off. Let me, let me go back and sit down and finish eating, you know, because my eating right now is more important than talking to y'all worldly, foolish people right now. You feel me? Dusting my feet off is more important than you right now Because the father is acting and you can't stop it I don't require nothing from you that you need to give up No, we taking it L Look, let me stop, let me stop Look, all praises to the most high Y'all be blessed I love y'all righteous brothers and sisters out there Do y'all thing And we rising I'm a, uh, Look, the, father's, the father is rising The most high is rising the Most High is coming out of his hiding place. Come on, how, 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 how do I need to say it for y'all to, to start getting it? Let me, you know, give me, give me, the, the, the Father's moving. Come on, what are we going to do? You know, if he going to move, why don't we move with him? If he going forward, let's go forward too. If he rising up, let's rise up too. Let's tell him, look, look, come on, bro. All praise to the Most High. It's time for me to go back and eat right now. I'm going to eat. Because this is what the Father has prophesied. While calamity is happening everywhere around about us, we're going to be sitting there, satisfied, eating, full, and we just going to la 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 
while y'all, ah, 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 you know, yelling and screaming because you're losing everything, but yet the righteous are now getting ready to, 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 to live in peace and safety while y'all in chaos. So let me go eat and fulfill scriptures by eating. <laughs> All praise to the Most High. Y'all be blessed. Shalom.